And I would like to share with all of you one of my very favorite hymns and the story behind that hymn. Be Thou My Vision is the song that we're going to look at today. And uh, it has one of the most beautiful melodies and some of the most beautiful lyrics of any of the great congregational songs in Christianity. And ironically, uh, no one knows who wrote the melody or the lyrics to the song. It is uh, an 8th century anonymous Irish hymn text that is set to an anonymous Irish traditional tune. So it is very, very old, uh, but it is my belief that the person we have most to thank for the song, Be Thou My Vision, uh, if we're going to attribute an author, is a guy who also lived a very long time ago, even before the 8th century, and his name is St. Patrick, a guy whose holiday that uh, we just celebrated recently. Now, we all know St. Patrick. He is the only saint with a global holiday and an official color, green, uh, mostly his holiday is used as an excuse to drink a gallon of beer, but he did not achieve sainthood by becoming a famous alcoholic. He was born in 373 AD in what is now called Scotland. His father was a deacon and his grandfather was a priest. And when Patrick, who was not a Christian, was around the age of 16 years old, raiders descended on his town, destroyed it, and took him to Ireland as a slave. And it was there in captivity, in slavery uh, in Ireland, that he gave his life to Christ and became a believer. And after six years as a slave in Ireland, he escaped and he returned home to his overjoyed family. But uh, one night when he was back home, he had a dream that was very reminiscent of Paul's vision of the Macedonian man in the book of Acts chapter 16. And in the dream, Patrick saw an Irishman who was pleading with him to come back and to share the gospel with Ireland. So he then went back to his former captors with only his Bible in his hand, and he evangelized the entire country. He planted over 200 churches, and, uh, and get this, he baptized over 100,000 converts in his ministry. Centuries later, the Irish church was still producing prayers, hymns, sermons, and songs of worship like this great song, Be Thou My Vision. Let me share it with you. Be Thou My Vision, O Lord of my heart, not be a less to me, say that thou art thou my best star by day or by night, waking or sleeping, thy presence, my life. beautiful song. Uh, there are a lot of great arrangements of it, so I encourage you to find one that you like and listen to it this week. I'll see you next time.